First of all, I should say that I am a practitioner and therefore that I'm speaking as a practitioner and with that particular narrow point of view, if you want to call it that, certainly both Gerald and Emily have a very different view and perhaps broader than my own. Uh, so I'm going to give some examples of things that we've worked on and some other examples that are related. Um, first of all, I want to, for you to think not of a place or uh, a, uh, a public place or a public park, but rather of a system of parks or a system of, um, of public places. And the reason I bring this up, um, and I'm giving an example from the past, which is that of uh, Minnesota's uh, Minneapolis parks specifically, in which you can see uh, a real system has been uh, created, but with a very interesting structure in the sense that they have a tax for parks. And this is one of the few places in the United States that has such a thing, but it has maintained, therefore, a very healthy system of parks. Um, but there are several reasons by which this shift to thinking about a system is important. And the, I wanted to talk about um, the fact that there are three different uh, things that are converging for us to want to think about systems. One of them has been, of course, the uh, abandonment of railroad, train, uh, railroad tracks, which has produced the linear park as a system and which uh, has provoked this new kind of park uh, all over the nation. The other thing has been the ecological data that has come to us that have shown that systems that are continuous have a greater health, uh, really support biodiversity, and uh, are able to maintain themselves in a much better condition. The third one is just our social mores, that we are much more depending on wanting to connect with something when we go to a public space and to transport ourselves to something through a public space. And therefore, in that particular case, uh, have wanted also in this uh, transportation to be able to walk or bike or run uh, to somewhere. This has meant a uh, bigger dimension to the space that we're asking from public space. Finally, the last uh, item that's been added to that is the health uh, issue, which has been tied to this walking and running and biking, and which has brought all kinds of health organizations into this uh, subject of discussing public space. So um, I'm just going to there's many uh, past examples of, uh, of systems.